Leaving a hot topic of conversation a few days ago, when Junho attended the VIP Cobweb film premiere. The reason is that on September 20th, Lee Junho and Lee Se Young were seen attending the same event after not meeting for almost a year since their second drama, The Red Sleeve. Various speculations and public assumptions colored Lee Junho's circle, which directed at Yuna at that moment, with the term X at the VIP premiere of the film Smuggler several times on July 20th. It is known that Yuna and Lee Soongi also ended the VIP event for the Smuggler's film premiere. Is it a coincidence that the circle seems to bear the term former real versus real? It's interesting that 2021 will be the year of Lee Junho and Lee Se Young's collaboration in the drama The Red Sleve. In 2022, the drama Lee Soongi and Lee Se Young. The Law Cafe ends with the marriage of the two characters in the drama, while the drama The Law Cafe is a reunion of the two in the previous drama entitled Wayugi, or A Korean Odyssey, in 2018. Continuing in 2023, seems like a perfect visual combination, Yuna, and Junho, in the drama King the Land, which also ended with a happy ending at a wedding. This speculation led to hopes and prayers for Yuna and Junho at a wedding in real life. Apart from that, what's interesting is that Lee Junho, Lee Soongi, and Yuna we're on the variety show Strong Heart, 2009-2010, where Lee Soongi was the host of the show. Lee Junho himself, when attending the VIP premiere of the Cobweb film, was still wearing an outfit from the same brand as Yuna some time ago. Both of them have also acquired other brands that have similar models as well. Netizen's focus shifted to Lee Junho's expression when he headed to the basement at the end of the event. A bad mood expression can be seen on Junho's face. It is assumed and speculated that Junho seemed uncomfortable when he was followed to the basement and opened the car door, which was considered unusual. Was there someone in Junho's car until Junho opened the door just a little? Meanwhile, the latest news is that Yuna and Junho will reunite on the Blu-ray of their drama. Apparently this is Junho's story, which was also revealed on a social media platform account that he had filmed a commentary on King the Land yesterday. Junho also added that it feels like now he is really letting go of King the Land. With this statement, the public thinks that Junho has also failed to move on from his drama. Are you the same?